that's everything on the van finish so all I need to do now to make it fully finished is change the air filter and change the oil and oil filter so let's go and do that now First up, I change the air filter. To change the air filter, you just remove a couple of screws from the air box. Hiya. And then manoeuvre the filter out. Not too bad to be fair. Gotta put a new one in. Pretty clean in there. Couple of bits of dust, but. Yeah, that's been clean fairly recently, I think. Then you just slot the new one in and screw the airbox back up. After that, I did an oil change on the van. This was something that I knew was due because the guy who I bought it off had mentioned it when selling. Doing the oil on a Renault Master is pretty easy. You don't even need to jack it up because there's plenty of space underneath. Just open up the filler cap and then unscrew the sump plug and drain all of the oil into a container. Once the oil is no longer draining out, just replace the sump plug. Don't nip this up too tight because you can damage the thread. It just needs to be lightly tightened. Then you can move on and change the filter. So you just unscrew the oil filter, which is nice and easy to access. Drain any excess oil from this before putting in a new O-ring to the filter housing. And then smear a little bit of fresh oil onto the gasket ring of the replacement filter which will lubricate the gasket, creating a good seal, and it also makes it a lot easier to come off next time you do the oil. Then just pop the filter back in the reverse way of how you removed it. You then just need to fill up the oil through the filler cap, this Renault Master requires 8 litres of oil, but beware that there may still be some oil left in the sump, so put in less and then check the dipstick before overfilling. A quick Google will let you know how much oil that your van needs. Once your level's correct, you're good to go for a few more thousand miles.
Now that the van's serviced, in the next video, I'm gonna be doing the long-awaited full van tour, showing you the inside and the outside of the van. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss that one. As always, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Oh,